Welcome back everyone. Seeing a little bit of sunshine there at the Dakota Magic Casino as we've had areas of gradually decreasing cloud cover since this morning. But looking at your first alert headlines, what we're watching for you. Uh, spotty showers arrive tomorrow. Right now they're out in western North Dakota. They'll arrive into eastern North Dakota into tomorrow morning. So mostly west of the Red River. Then through the rest of the week, temperatures remaining a bit above average and a little bit of good news, seeing some more sunshine towards the end of the work week. Looking even further ahead, that first alert into mid month, temperatures remaining above average, and we're looking at a couple more chances of precipitation, some of which could be frozen depending on uh, temperatures at the time they develop. More on that later. But right now, satellite and radar showing a mix of sunshine and clouds through much of the valley here in the southern valleys where we've had some clearing. Northeastern North Dakota finally seen Seeing some clearing as well, but a couple of isolated showers nudging into uh, eastern North Dakota. More of the steady rainfall remains out to the west. Right now in Fargo, we are mostly sunny, 43 degrees. More headed 43 as well with a relatively light wind. Grain Forks partly cloudy, 40 degrees, feeling like 37. 36, the air temperature in Langdon, 37 in Jamestown. 45, Alexandria and Fergus Falls, a couple of the warmer spots there. 44 in Baudette, 40 Bemidji, 39 in Oaks. If you're still heading to the polls this evening, here's what you can expect. Might want to grab that jacket. Temperatures by 6 p.m. only dropping a couple of degrees from where we are right now, but a little on the cooler side and a few more clouds filling in too. So expect some increasing cloud cover through the rest of tonight. And we're also watching for the redevelopment of additional fog in northeastern North Dakota through tomorrow morning. We'll have to keep an eye on it. Depends if enough clouds can clear. But another thing, those spotty showers uh, developing through eastern North Dakota primarily a couple parts of the Southern Valley generally looking pretty light through the morning hours. Otherwise, we hold on to that mix of sun and clouds all the way through our Wednesday and temperatures not too different from what we've seen the last couple of days, ranging from the upper 30s to some low and mid 40s. Our then next chance of precipitation comes late Saturday from the south and continues into early Sunday morning. Many folks at least seen the chance for a little bit of precipitation and that looks to remain as rain as temperatures will be on the warmer side overnight upper 30s to low 40s with highs in the 50s. It's next week Justin between about Tuesday and Thursday still a lot of questions on timing and track. Yeah. But a couple of our longer range models mm -hmm. maybe showing a little bit of wintry weather arriving. I like you hadn't said the SN word. You worked no. around it. You yeah. Frozen <laughs> precipitation, wintry weather. I refuse to say it yet. <laughs> Give it time. Thanks, Summer. <laughs> Up next, I want to see you do that all, all winter if you can pull it off. Up next, the steps you can take to ensure the dry weather we've had doesn't cause a flare-up in your respiratory problems, including asthma. But first, a look at the markets today.